Hello, in this video, I'm going to tell you about kilocalories. So a kilocalorie is the amount of heat energy it takes to raise the temperature of one kilogram of water by one degree Celsius. So we use kilocalories as a measure of the potential energy that's contained in food and as a measure of the energy that the body uses throughout the day. Um, now, I want to clarify kilocalorie versus calorie. So the term kilocalorie is the scientifically, mathematically correct term uh, to describe the amount of heat energy that I just defined for you. In the U.S., we use the word calorie incorrectly. So on our food labels in the U.S., it says, like in our food label over here, calories 60, really technically we mean kilocalories 60. So in other countries around the world where they're using the correct term kilocalorie on their food labels in other countries, you see KCAL and that stands for kilocalorie. That is equivalent to what we just refer to as a calorie in the US. So that is technically incorrect, but that is the convention here. Um, so there are technically, mathematically, a thousand calories in one kilocalorie, hence the prefix kilo. Um, but in the U.S., we have the convention of using just calorie to mean the same thing as kilocalorie. Um, so when we look at our macronutrients, uh, we get calories from carbohydrates, proteins, fats, and alcohol. Um, as I've discussed in past videos, alcohol is not a nutrient because we don't have a deficiency disease if we don't have it anymore. Um, so technically not a nutrient, but because we get calories from alcohol, we still need to consider the caloric value of alcohol if we're tracking our nutrition or calculating our calories. Um, so here I included um, a, a graph, not a graph, a table um, for both kilocalories and calories to just demonstrate that we're using them synonymously, that they technically don't mean the same thing, but we use them as if they do. Um, so we get four calories or kilocalories per gram of carbohydrate and per gram of protein. We get nine calories or kilocalories per gram of fat, and we get seven calories or kilocalories per gram of alcohol. All right, that's all I have for you in this video. Thanks so much for watching.